uh, uh, it smells so bad. And I know that it smells bad because I, I'm like slightly stuffed. Yes. And I could still smell that. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh my gosh. It holds the shape. Oh, of, of broccoli. You got a real, you got a real big piece. I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm proud of you, Mike. And it's. This it's, is so surreal. <laughs> It's it, so. It's like it a looks, toy you'd buy. Right. It looks like broccoli. Yeah. But from Fisher Price. Right. But it's it's super light. It's yeah. not as heavy as you think it should be. Is this a movie prop? Maybe we're just eating movie props. Oh, this there's no way this can be good. <laughs> there's no way. There's no way. It 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 honestly just smells like nothingness, yeah. but awful. Awful nothingness. <laughs> Like going into an old attic. Right. <laughs> yeah. It's empty. Right. They, they couldn't make this like ranch flavored. <laughs> I decided not to get bamboo. Okay, okay. Because. Much to my chagrin. This, this drink has the worst English on it. It won't tell you what's in it. Okay. <laughs> and you didn't want to give me cancer. Yes. So, so instead you got me. It's uh, okay. So there's this. <laughs> that it looks... And then it says keep heatiness away. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Keep <laughs> heating this away. It says drink Gia Duo Bao. <laughs> and so there's nothing on here that tells you what's what, in it. Or what flavor it is. Well, I, I'm probably, I'm sure it does if we just can't read it. Yeah. The only word I understand is botanical beverage. So you might be drinking a flower. Right. Mm-hmm. I feel like this is like, um, uh, I feel like this is like an energy drink. Yes. I'm I'm excited for this. This, this ooh, is, the the can is is gold in color. Yes. There's so, a bunch of writing on it. I don't know if it's it, it's not. Chi- it doesn't look like Chinese it characters. It says herbal tea, uh, made from prime herbal ingredients. Whatever that means. I, it, prime. Yes. Oh, it's it is Chinese. It's from Hangzhou, Beijing, China. What does it say? And I apologize. It says serve hot or cold. Some. Precipities are natural herbal materials which are safe for drinking. Ooh, it's got chrysanthemum oh, in it. Oh, nice. And Japanese honeysuckle. Where do you see that? Oh, and I see that. It's got heal all, which sounds like a Pokemon product. Same thing with frangipini. Frangipini. And masona. And Chinese licorice. So, as promised, this will keep the heatiness away. <laughs> JD. Right. <laughs> it's a delicious way to snack. Is that what it says? Yes. <laughs> but I can't. Mm-hmm. Okay. So I'm opening the package. It's like a silvery package. Let's see what it smells like. It smells. It smells like that cookie tin <laughs> at your grandmother's house. Yes. <laughs> um, it, it's got like the really boring shortbread cookies, but mm-hmm. whenever you open it up, you think it's cookies. It's actually just her sewing kit. Yeah. <laughs> That's what it smells like. <laughs> Apt description. <laughs> oh, oh my! It's very crumbly. Mm-hmm. It's almost like um, it's it's almost like um, like astronaut freeze dried <laughs> yes. food. I would eat this on a on a rocket. Also, can I just say? This looks nothing like the box. This mm-hmm. looks like a pale, sad version of what's on the box. Photoshop. Unbelievable. Mm-hmm. But it is coconut flavored, and I do really enjoy coconut. Yes. So hopefully this doesn't ruin coconut for me. Right. So bo- bottoms up. Mm-hmm. It's really chalky. Mm-hmm. And it's like coconut flavored. But then it's got that bean paste flavor. Yeah. It's it's very heavy on the tongue. It tastes it tastes it tastes like exactly what heartburn should taste like. <laughs> this is the physical personification of heartburn. <laughs> oh lord. Uh, no, he had nothing to do with this. <laughs> this was not made on days one for six. No. Clearly, it was mechanically separated. Yes. This was obviously the work of Satan. <laughs> this mechanically separates my soul from pleasure. Ugh. If you did, if you want to prove a total depravity, you just oh, tasted no. it. Yes. Ugh. That is total depravity. This is like one of the top five worst things I've ever eaten. <laughs> lobster juice is number one. Yeah, lobster juice is still number one. Yeah, we did. 
very buttery and tame. <laughs> yeah, you should have some, Andre. <laughs> yes, we good. still have it in our fridge. Uh, I'm good. Uh, so, uh, it's still, it's, my mouth is still hot. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> this is disgusting. I'm throwing this away. That's actually too good. Yeah. I'm, I, we should, you know what we need to do? We need to salt and burn these. That's what we need to do. Yeah. We, maybe they need to be cooked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe that's where we messed up. <laughs> maybe it's a seasoning. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I feel sorry for all the pigs and cows that lost their lives to be made into this <laughs> yes. monstrosity. Well, if it helps you feel better, those animals are still alive. Don't forget about the, <laughs> oh, right, cause... Don't forget about the fingernails. Uh. <laughs> so, I hope it tastes good with cilantro and jalapeno Jalapeno hummus. <laughs> hummus. So cilantro and jalapeno hummus. Yo, man, I don't know if you know this, Mike, but I don't like cilantro. Oh, no! <laughs> I'm so excited for this. This is gonna be so bad. <laughs> like cilantro is like my I don't I don't like cilantro. Like at Chipotle, like I don't get this I don't get the cilantro rice. I get, oh, no. I get the other rice. Yeah. I bet it's good though. Let me smell. It smells like hummus. Yeah, it smells good. Yeah. So hopefully the pumpkin. The pumpkin. Can I can I try this just on its own yes. first? Let's see, I'm gonna grab, I'm gonna grab, oh, I'm gonna grab two of these. I'm, I'm reaching into the box. There's some very festive things on the back and that look very juicy. Tons of pumpkin. Now, if pumpkin spice has nothing to do with pumpkins, can I create the next craze and call it a scarecrow shavings? Maybe, maybe. <laughs> um, it smells like a Triscuit tracker and vaguely like a candle store. Mm hmm. Salty. Salty. Sweet. Sweet. Pumpkin powdery. Pumpkin powdery. You know what? I almost wish there was more pumpkin. Right. Yeah. So, I'm now dipping it into the hummus. <laughs> um, this is going to be really interesting. Because I know the flavor of, of hummus. Mm -hmm. And I know the flavor of cilantro. And I know the flavor of jalapeno. <laughs> I know that they don't go with pumpkin. <laughs> No, they don't. Bottoms yeah, up, Mike. Bottoms up. It's weird. Mm. Mm. It's not as jalapeno as I thought. Yeah. <laughs> it makes me think I just ate some Indian food mm -hmm. and then went to Starbucks. Right. <laughs> Eating Indian food. While drinking yes. a frappuccino. Yes. <laughs> First of all, I'm really glad that it didn't turn out as bad as I thought it was no. going to. Oh, let me describe the smell to you. Um, <laughs> it's what the mop bucket <laughs> and then the quarter of would smell like after a hard day's of cleaning. <laughs> if you ever go to the fish market and put your head into the garbage of unused things, <laughs> It probably would mirror this smell. Oh, God. Mike, you're killing me. Yeah. Yes, oh, good I think they're small. <laughs> oh, you just went for it. No no fanfare. I'm scared. Mmm. Fishy? <laughs> you have just given us a big lemon face. Um, at first it tastes like nothing. Always a good start. And then... It tastes like a fisherman's boot. Like, oh! Oh, so it looks like baklava. Shredded. Ooh. You don't like baklava? No, it just like looks funny. Here, it's it looks like shredded wheat and tofu had a baby, <laughs> and then walnuts came out. It's. Um, I don't think I can eat this based on the smell. It's incredibly dry. It looks yeah. You know, it smells yeah. like a Lysol I once it's had. Dry. Did you eat some? Did you eat some? Hold on, no, not yet. Did you did you eat it? It looks kind of like fluffy. How's it taste? It's got the consistency of cotton candy. Cotton candy. But it tastes like the smell of a very clean rug store. <laughs> <laughs> I think it tastes I think it tastes like fruit loops. <laughs> <laughs> this tastes like fruit loops. Or like those um, 
fruity pebbles. <laughs> they t- it tastes like fruity pebbles. Oh man, this is gonna be so gross. What is this yeah. for? Dude, this isn't even like a drink, dude. This is like a seasoning. <laughs> it's like, I-, I was hoping it's just pure butter. <laughs> isn't that what that is? Isn't that what so- that sauce mm-hmm. is? Yeah, see though, we can't open it. So we're wasting precious time trying to get lobster juice open. Which I'm sure Andrew's more than okay with. <laughs> you know what? I'm, I'm going to forego the, the competition, and I'm just going to say, I take a swig, you take a swig. <laughs> okay. Ready? Main lobster juice. Bro, I took the one sniff and I almost puked. Mm. Oh gosh. Mm. You know, it's, it's very tame. It's tame? <laughs> Don't lie to me, Mike. <laughs> it's a soft taste. It's a soft taste. You know what it smells like? It smells like um, the trash bin at a, um, at, a, at a sushi restaurant where they throw in the scraps. <laughs> You know what I mean? Like, like, you know, the new guys like trying to make sushi. Yeah. <laughs> and messes up the roll. Yeah. And they're just like, we can't serve this. <laughs> Throws it in the trash. Yes. All right. Time to put your lobster where your mouth is. It says certified main lobster. So. You're getting the quality. best. You're getting the best. Bottoms up. Yeah, real subtle, Mark. <laughs> I'm kind of sorry. Um, <laughs> that that taste isn't going away, Mike. Yes, it is because for your for your help, I'm giving you sweet and salty pretzels. 